don't mind posting my man. Like me, I don't use to shave when I have man. I don't. Everybody must. Know. Everybody must know. Welcome to my channel. If this is the first time you're seeing this beautiful face, hi, my name is Kamsi Navani. Please don't make it your last by clicking on the subscribe button and giving this video a big thumbs up if you end up enjoying it. <laughs> and if it's not, hi guys, welcome back. Okay guys, so today I have another guest with me. Introduce yourself. Hi guys, my name is Adobe, aka Aurobo Foodie. Follow that on Instagram. <laughs> and yeah, so I brought you another guest, guys, to talk about something... Very popular, hmm, which is <laughs> 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 which is you know dating mistakes. You know, ladies, we when we get into relationships, emotions run high. We're excited, and sometimes you know, we girl, make mistakes we should not be making. We know better. We know better. We know better. <laughs> so this is just be more of like a conversation, not necessarily like giving pointers because mm -hmm. I'll change my approach to like. Instead of saying don't do this more like oh what do you think about yeah. this and you give your own yeah. um two cents. So are you ready? Let's go. Okay. Alright guys, so the first mistake I have here is you know, keeping on the first date. What are your thoughts on that? <laughs> <laughs> do you think you should be listening somebody mm. on the first date and all of that? You know the degrees of lipstick. Mm? Okay. There's just a peck on the lips. There's the one that you insert. <laughs> your tongue, <laughs> your tongue gets to their throat. Okay. You reach your suffocus, and you're asking uh -huh. why. <laughs> Generally, I'm like, if if you guys know what the mood is carrying you, it's just if it's just a little kiss, like a little. Okay. That's cute. It's alright, but like, if you guys are going to be exchanging saliva and merging your tongues, mm -hmm. maybe wait a little bit, take a break, yeah. take a step back. I feel like if you don't know that person at all, and yeah. this was like the first day, I honestly would not. Say okay, that's true. Yeah. Like if it's somebody I met in the club the night before, yeah, and you're like, oh, let's go and do brunch the next day, and then you have the F one three, the audacity. To try and bring your crusty ass lips <laughs> to my face, you don't know. We're gonna he have a big it. problem. Yeah. You don't know what he drank last night. His mouth could be smelling. You don't know that he brushed this morning. Nothing. Honey, um, baby. Yeah. Don't do that. I don't think you should. Yeah. If there's yeah. like past history, you guys know yourself a little bit better. Yeah. And like you guys have been yearning for time, or maybe your even old friends who finally just found the spark. Yeah, then yeah, like well. there's not there's no big deal in a little kiss between what's a kiss amongst friends. But yeah, like if it's like a complete stranger, like mm -hmm. honey. No. Let's, like let me just say this now. Like STDs are not just for your genitals. <laughs> your your mouth as well. Yeah. Herpes is a thing. It, yeah, yeah. It is how you still for yeah. them. Yeah. So I think so I think be careful. So what do you now what do you now think if we now move into the the do 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 Yeah, what do you think of the first day uh hmm. really soon? Kind of anyway. like, hmm, it's a bit of a tricky one, isn't it? <laughs> To me, it's not tricky, sir. <laughs> Don't do it. I personally, I feel like, I feel in this day and age, everybody wants to form cool yeah. and liberate. Even though that's, I don't know what you mean by liberated. I don't understand where this pressure to have sex suddenly came from. Like, oh, yeah, know, I've lost my virginity. Duh. Like, not even on virginity, or based on how, how, or how so, much, or how little yeah, you yeah, have sex. Like, like if you, if you're the type of person that you meet someone and you have sex with them, that's fast. That's cool with that's you. That's fine. Like, if that's what you're doesn't, into, it doesn't make you good any you. more or, or less. better than the people who decide not yeah. to. And I just feel like besides STDs, I, I, I just feel like it's a very intimate thing. And then it's about spirits. So time, you would have wondered why you can't get over this man. You don't know that they tied your name inside Calabash. You won't remind me. On top of your head, they are killing goats. And you are being fat. They are killing goats. This is this are the issues. This Girl, is the issues. Baby, just, wise up, honey. You wise up. You don't know where that man has been. Okay. I'm just saying, like, at least I feel maybe get to know the person. Yeah. To some extent, or you know, I don't know. I mean, get past just their name. Like that's yeah. my thing. Like if people tell me, oh, like they think they're moving too fast, like. That's first of all, it's your experience, yeah. it's yours, you own that. It depends but, like, on, it, everyone's journey like, is different. Th but I'm just saying, what try, she try said. to be careful. Yeah. You know, just, just don't be with everybody you see. Just don't. Maybe don't, if it happens to this 
with this one person mm-hmm. okay cool but like it doesn't have it doesn't mean it has to happen with the next that, one that's like the, yeah. just because everybody's doing it doesn't mean you have to jump on the bag with that as well do what feels natural to you listen to that little voice in your head that little listen, listen to her voice, that's really your mind talking yeah. like that's your logical mind don't just think with your heart that oh man like he's not gonna like me if i don't yeah. put out if he doesn't like you can keep walking yeah and sometimes he, there are many fish in the sea we are in the Atl- atlantic is not far <laughs> Sometimes, I mean, your heart can be saying something, but like, check with your brain sometimes. And, and always be sure that you're not being pressurized by the other person. Because yeah. that can, and you don't think it's from you, yeah, anymore, it's just from that person. Mm-hmm. So, um, from there, we're jumping into another dating mistake. Uh, this actually happened recently with a celebrity, yeah. a big one. And, you know, she went through a lot of backlash yeah. and all of that. And that is um, sending news or mm. like filming a sex tape. So, I mean, people always kind of cringe at themselves. You know, it's, it's happened. Yeah, it's very like, common. So everybody, I don't know have, why everybody suddenly, what like, the heck? Like, oh, like, what the heck? That? Sex tape? News? But where are the views coming from? Bro, like, what? <laughs> like, like, coming from somewhere. So, um, yeah, in this dating age, what do you think? Do you, do you advise <laughs> girls to do that? Or, yeah. I will say that if you're doing it, if you're sending anything, one, number one, the number one rule. This is also, this is after you've obviously decided to change, to send it because at that point nobody can really change your mind. But if you're going to do it, what, number one, no face, no, no one, case. no case. I'm going to say it again, no face, no case. There's no reason your face should be inside there. That's not what they want to see, dear. <laughs> Yourself, like yeah. you know, it's cool know what they're looking for. They're, if you want to see your face, Instagram. <laughs> Bro, like do you know what I mean? Like there's no reason to put your face there and then put yourself at more risk of like what's it called? I don't I don't feel embarrassment, but like yeah, just avoiding a painful situation. Yeah. Number two, let it be something you trust. Yeah. And I don't mean this one week relationship that oh my yeah. god, even if it's your boyfriend, sky, like, it doesn't it doesn't mean yeah. that you have to because I mean like, like she said, is it so is it relationship substantial? Is it new? Because no one is new, like anyone is I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, everybody's excited. Oh my god, I have to do this, I have to please him, I have to keep him interested. No, honey. Yeah, you don't have to do it. We all know that. what he's looking for and it's not yeah, and yeah. then I also feel like before, because why not again? Why not tell you do don't, don't do, do, yeah. do you, hun? But what I'm trying to say, like, I think it's good to um, take note of all the their consequences and so things that might go wrong. For yeah. example, whoever you're sending to might not be the one that leaks it or something. Bro, maybe he might have friends that hmm. see it and then send it to them you know, and send it to them. Something like this happened in secondary when I was in secondary school. So let's see, let's give them names. I like giving my characters names. Okay. So now we have Peter, Paul, and Angela. This is your <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so Angela sent a need to Peter. Hmm? Peter finished his schooling. Peter was happy. He went on his merry way. Peter graduated. Hmm. Peter, and what's it called? This was like a year later. It wasn't even like immediately. So just so you know that the effects can like, they might be delayed. You might, you might, you might send it to you think that, oh, what's it called? It's done and dusted. Yeah. But... In case of Angela and Peter, Angela sent Angela sent it a year ago. A year later, Paul, who is friends with Peter, then decides that he's he comes across this thing and he decides that oh, he's going to take it upon himself to release it. For whatever reason, Paul decided that that was a good idea. Yeah. Paul is obviously on crack, but <laughs> that's <laughs> that's besides the point. Yeah. Like, do you know? I, like, I, I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. Yeah. So, I, yeah, the girl send the what even the one that released it was his friend that released it, and he released it a year later, and he made so. it into such a spectacle. Like, oh it was like he was like the town crier trying to deliver news. It was beating drum. Yeah. Everybody was lining up to see that pee, and it was so traumatic for her. Like. And that's secondary screen. No, that's secondary kids, kids, kids are vicious. Kids are kids mean. Are mean. Like, adults can have uh, consequences. Kids like it's not that deep. Because at least adults, like, we, all, we almost kind of understand the consequences of doing certain things. Like, yeah. We're not fully there yet, yeah. but like kids, no sense of not no sense of right or wrong, but we don't care. Not that we don't know mm. right or wrong. We just don't care. So in secondary school and boys are boys are different. Secondary school. boys are a different breed. Yeah, secondary school to this. Yeah, <laughs> so every point in time. Yes, I just feel it's just um, it's just better when you think it through. Yeah, a lot. See, I I always talk about your branding and everything. You have to know will this thing come back and hurt me? And I'm yeah. saying as now you're older because I mean you're older now. You're getting you you have more sense now. You understand things better. So it's like with this artist now, no one was blaming who did it. 
You're blaming her. That's the real question, And that's guys. the reality. That's the real Because, like, that's you... The women get so, so much shit Even though she's the victim. She is yeah. the victim. Yeah. And nobody wants to stop to be like, oh, my God. How dare they release it? They were like, no, you're How a dare you? You're this one. How dare you give it so much attention? Like, why? There is no reason for that, that to have made four front page news. Like, mm-hmm. why? What? What is the news there? I can't what? How what that do you know what I mean? Like, it got so much traction, and for what? Yeah. Like, no, know that at every point in time, I say, woman, you're always going to get the backlash or whatever. So don't ever, don't ever you think make. that the man that is, is going to not get... going to be the same. So that's why you have to think for yourself, like. Whatever he's telling, oh, baby, 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 ignore it. Think, do I want to do this? Am I ready for any? Anything can go left, bro. You know, so it's like if if you now want to do it, what Adobe mm. says, I think that's not your best. <laughs> <laughs> Because I feel, I feel like this um, celebrity, if she didn't have her face there, you I feel like she could have, you she could have denied it until she died. Guys, yeah, imagine her now. She's not the only one that has the tattoo Bro. or anything. She could have, but... All she had to come out and say was, prove it. Prove Everybody, it. shut up. And that would be done. And you can't do that. So, um, you just have to, like I always say, even though your heart is in, you always have to check it with your brain. And make sure if you want to, it's because you want to. Okay, yeah. Like, you not, trust yourself, you trust him, you trust your position in that relationship. And it's not because he's constantly yeah. making demands. Not because saying, "Ah, oh, now, baby, if you love me, you send it." Uh, uh-uh. uh. Yeah. No. If that I, is I what, say which is, some people even do when it's never. Yeah. yeah. Girl, you are strong. Yeah. You, that. you are strong I because it won't be the I'm just like you don't even know. You know, imagine if he's not. Yeah. If that he doesn't owe you. There's anything. no commitment like, there. Like there's no. You sending him that will not do anything. It will yeah. not make him. If now he's, want not to interested, come he's, he's not interested. He's not interested. Like, and I think for like for example, the celebrity like how how work. I mean, she's an artist. Mm-hmm. So it, it to be honest, like yeah, she got some backlash, but mm-hmm. her music is still. Yeah, good. do you get? But if she was like right now, a maybe, conservative career, like imagine she was like running like a lawyer. She was, what, a she was a lawyer or, she was running, firm. or one of those like mommy blogs like oh if she was doing one of those mommy nah, blogs like that's in nigeria she was like yeah. law firm imagine all the, oh my god that yeah, was they would, that didn't know her job that's There's, really like most men barely respect women like, like mental your achievements now imagine if you know so consider all these factors and now no is it worth it before even reach oh do i trust him no that, that should be like the last one mm-hmm. consider how does this affect me how will it affect me down the line down the line then the last one i'm like oh do, do I, I trust him that's it so um yeah i think i think that's it for that the next dating mistake i don't know if it's not really a mistake but it's more like a conversation like <laughs> it's your <enjoy> journey <laughs> i don't know what it is okay, so this was um social media relationships hmm. Mm. Mm. Those you gotta put smiley face on your you boyfriend. You put your face. boyfriend, but your boyfriend has cupcake head. <laughs> Why does your head boyfriend have monster? <laughs> Is he a ghost? Mm. <laughs> Why? Guys, um, if so you don't want think? to post your man, don't keep him to yourself. Him. Don't it? post him. Don't be like you're not gonna tag it. Oh, what's going on? Don't, don't even bother. Don't. Something like that. Like like. What was I, the reason? I just feel like if if you have to, clearly you want to. Yeah. So I mean, just do it with your chest. I, I get it if it's like a little key intimate dinner, like you're doing, yeah, like you're doing your picture of the place. Of his you guys, this is why. We see you, girl. We see, we see you. you. <laughs> but not the one that he's full guy, but You people would have stood, you would have stood for portraits, two of them together. All of a sudden, you they, and Mr. Smiley are. Uh, uh, they do so not really like do sense. I'm like, you really went all that stress. Don't yes. post him. I feel because I even like, like, obviously, I'm not the social media relationship girl. I'm not claiming to yeah. be. But I'm just like, what's the need of me teasing? Like, mm-hmm. I. I generally don't have any. I don't. I don't crave anything. I don't yeah. care posting. Some mm-hmm. people really want to, but maybe they don't know where their relationship yeah. is. Yeah, they're not sure, so they hide. But me, I have no inkling or desire. <laughs> like I really don't care. I feel like I fall into that category of people. Like I don't mind posting my man. Like me, yeah, I don't used to shave when I have man. I don't. <laughs> Everybody must. Know. Everybody must know. Okay. <laughs> I've been single for 19 years. Yeah. No, but things are like, if I, I'm in a point in my relationship where I'm like, okay, I don't really know where we stand. I don't really know if you're really committed into this and if this can go the distance. I'm not going to post you on my social media. Yeah. The most you get is my close friend story. Period. Yeah. If we are not at a point where like, okay, I can see that this is go- this is actually going somewhere. I'm committed to you. You are committed to me. Mm-hmm. It is a, what's it called? There's mutual respect within that relationship. You're not going yeah. to go and embarrass me on the streets. Then yeah. I will post you. And they've never like, oh, you'll be the only person I'm posting you. Yeah. Like, you, you, nobody will even know you're my man self. <laughs> like, well, they they'll, they'll, they'll try to have seen your face, but yeah. they won't even know it's you. But like, I'm not gonna, what's it called, then be posting you from the dump when we're in talking stages, basically. Yeah. Oh, I don't like embarrassment. I don't. You shouldn't like it either. shouldn't like it either. But um, moving on from that, just like, let's say you're with somebody, you're dating someone, and then 
um, he doesn't post you on social media. Is that an issue? Do you think it's a red flag if that happens? I mean, why are you not people? posting me? I'm not so strict. In all situations, <laughs> okay, not in all yeah. situations. Like, if your boyfriend is not like a social media person, he's not like he's, as for like he has that one post on Instagram yeah, from yeah. 2016. Like, in his story, he's just like, Oh, he doesn't really like he doesn't post anything on the story. He's most, most you can get from him is maybe his close friends every yeah. now and then. Yeah, why and are you expecting? I doesn't post, that's, yeah, why, like, that's like, why that's fine. Like, like, expecting him to even post you is a bit of a stretch, like, yeah, you know, because that's you not know, him. That's you, exactly, you know, the, the, you know the pressure you're with. with, yeah, that's not him. But like, if he's the one that from 7 a.m. when he wakes up, he'll say, and grateful. <laughs> Tell me when he goes to bed and he says, "Thank God for like, today." It's like with the <laughs> and you, you have got you. Ever. You are doing disappearing acts. Okay, Never my dear ever. red flag. Like the flag is waving. But then again, we let's down balance it because again, like he, he might still not like to press his relationship. Like, yeah, yeah, he can be open about yeah. everything except the, that. The intimate, so I just think it in, depends. Yeah, because even people, like some people who post everything, they're just and they're just be yeah. dead. The guy is still. The guy is embarrassing you. He's your still face straight as his deep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what about if he doesn't post you on your birthday? Yeah. It's a bit sketch, but honestly, Kinda like, if he doesn't post you on his birthday, he's an op. He's actually an op. But I will post my friend. Like if you are no, actually but, my guys, yeah. my, I post my guys on their birthday. I don't care, even if I'm not on yeah. social media at that time. I maybe that's just me. I will make an effort to like but post you feel, on some story. Maybe yeah. not Instagram. Maybe Snapchat or something, yeah. depending on where I am in my social media life at that point in time. But I feel like there's, there's a point sometimes. I don't, see this. Take this because some of you will think I'm like, okay, yes. <laughs> wait, so, wait. What you say? But I'm saying that there's a situation yeah, that maybe you'll be with people for an amount of time. Yeah. You're that confident that even he doesn't even have. To. Cause you guys, yeah. she I'm spending it with you. That's true. She doesn't really have That's to. True. Like for example, if I spend the whole day, um, you we were so. Su- um, so yeah. you got me gifts and an amazing yeah, that's time true, that's true. and then you put on I don't really care like, I feel like there's a point you get to in your relationship that like, you yeah. don't need that social media validation yeah but it depends on your relationship so I feel like if he's not treating you I feel like that's when girls get if he's treating you um, badly off social media that's when it gets like why yeah. you not putting me on because it's like because now it's, it's, it's a thing of insecurity like yeah. okay you're already treating me this way when it's just the two of us yeah. and like you're so now hiding you from the public yeah because like, like, social really media is not real life it's really not and also don't get us wrong like there's a difference between being private and being secretive yes, in your relationship. Yeah, so, exactly. To find the line and make sure like your man is not yeah. crossing it or you're not crossing it. Because I because well. I feel like sometimes me, I'm really big on branding, for example, mm-hmm. and um I'm not one in terms of relationship. I wouldn't want to put my relationship out there because it's mm-hmm. just not my brand. And yeah. I would want a partner that understands that and doesn't care. Yeah. So I don't I can't be naive. But mm-hmm. at the same time I won't now put on my stories ah where are all the men now? Where I'm saying, do you understand? It, that's the like, how is he supposed to feel? Like, do you understand? If so it's good and fine if he does it, not mm-hmm. think all he doesn't even. No one knows, but if he's now really out there posting memes, maybe like yeah. just in the boy memes about all like, them bad, where them bad bitches at? Yeah, mm, I, so that, <laughs> I think that's the only one. Like, uh, sis, that's mm-hmm. us because yeah. that's very. That means that not, the people in his DMs that are responding to that because he's not and, and he because he, he's giving an impression that there's clearly no yeah. one there. You don't have to put me, you don't have to put respect yeah, exactly. me. Exactly. Like, um, social media, while well, like on the fence, I think it depends on so many things. So please don't take what I say. I say, what I say, you can put your birthday. Sis, don't mean that the relationship has spoiled. So it does not mean. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it for that. Uh, would you have any other mistakes? I think, what do you think about dating his friends? Ooh, Frankie, mm-hmm. how close are they? <laughs> Because you know the guys have like, oh, the guys are being always. If his best friend is coming to you after, that is so uh, Because guys don't feel like that. They have eye open. They have plans for you. exceptions, but I just feel like it's very suspicious. The two of them want to destroy your life, dear. Yeah. <laughs> Run away. I remember when we were younger, there was this group. I don't want to say the group now before they come and attack me on the social, on the social media. <laughs> yeah. There was a rumor that like part of the initiation was that like, any girl, because like, it was a group of guys, and any girl who wanted to join the group to be associated with the guys, yeah. they had to make that round God forbid yeah. Yeah. I would say can avoid like, if you can it. avoid just the same circle yeah. date one friend you date two so you dated them all what size are you looking for in that circle who about yeah. siblings yeah. <laughs> <laughs> meeting parents you got up at the gate ah what should they do <laughs> no no, no. no. I mean, <laughs> what, what do you think about that in terms of girls like um, let's say like this guy moves to your friend and then maybe mm. for some maybe they were talking and then now he's moving to you. You think like it's a, like <laughs> you know girl could. What do you but, think about that? Yeah, I'm ashamed to say that with the two many of these. I think I think 
everybody at some point. I'm so ashamed to say at this, some but point like, has. I feel like with me and my friends, what has really saved our friendship is that we have always had like open, honest conversations about, Which is very we, about everything. So like we literally lay everything bare on the table. Like we talk about it, like, okay, like this is what is happening. Like and it doesn't it's not like you do it when you get caught to so you do it from the jump. Yeah. This person is moving to me, this is how yeah. I feel about it. Like and I wouldn't go to her with something that's flimsy. So like if it's just that like, oh I want to like give this mm. guy I wouldn't go to her with that because especially if I knew that she really liked him I wouldn't cross that line you have to understand that if you're crossing that line it has to be for somebody that is worth it yeah and but I also think the problem is that girls lie about how much they actually did like because the next year they're like I don't like true. you I don't like you I like, I when like you now move to your friend he's like but, but you but you say you don't like him that much so <laughs> I'm like, you only do it yourself if you lie. Like, just say it. Okay. For me personally, I don't, I'm not anyone's second. So, that's never, it, it's never worked for me. Point it's, blank, period. It's never, because, like, you already went from a friend, I'm so sorry. If it wasn't me, you should have called me, me first. But, like, I don't, I'm so sorry. What if, what's it called? You didn't know You him. did, like, you guys never knew each other. Like, the only reason you met him that's a bit different because you didn't know what he met you off, you, like, he was with your friend. I want to be the kind of thing. No, like, okay, 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 okay. I want to be the kind of thing that, like, as soon as you like, I don't believe in love at first sight, but like, as soon as you saw him, it's kind of like you both of you just knew. Do you know what I mean? That's you just kind of knew. That's very that, like, messy. Hmm, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Honestly, th- does my friend like him? Like, really as well, like. like like the relationship is going well, but your friend too is looking kind of messy. But like, <laughs> honestly, I I consider myself such a girl's girl. I I don't know. I'm not being okay, there, but okay. I, I feel like I wouldn't. You would if she really does like. Okay, what if it gets to a point, point that like, okay, they're not together. They're not together, and it's been like a messy breakup. Like, is she my? Like, she really doesn't like him anymore. Is she my like, she close friend? Like my, she's my sister. She's my close. Friend. Okay. Yes, I know. Both scenarios. Which one is yes, I know. No, both scenarios. Okay. Like different scenarios. No, okay. If she's my close, I'm just yeah. like, okay, that's no. fair enough. That's fair enough. Okay. No, but if she's not, like we just have like friend group. Yeah. Let me, I'm trying to be like, like, I can't if lie. you're not my guy, I'm swiping him there. Yes, guys, are you mad? Please, you have fun with the band. Does it mean I will not knock on my play? Ah. <laughs> what's, what's the meaning? It's just hard sometimes. Like, I get the whole what's it called um, girl code thing and like not what's it called, like crossing those lines. But sometimes, honestly, like the conversations are so important. Communication is key in every t- type of relationship, be it friendships or like romantic relationship or whatever. Yeah. Always talk it out. Yeah. They'll act according to what you've said to them. So if you dead ass don't feel comfortable with it, let them know. Let them know. Yeah. And then let it not be like it was out And then you as a friend don't be like sneaky about it. Yeah. Like, tell her point point blank like ah uh, this guy is moving to me on what's up. You think about being friends with like your your friend's partner. Ah. Thank you for what <laughs> Why are you pulling each other? So that's like, a stretch. Okay. Okay. Follow each other because each other. Okay. So yeah, I can yeah. use either a cut to spare the other person. But if it's also different if what's it if your friend and this guy were friends before both of you. Like before you met the guy, do you know what I mean? I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if like the cousins when you were small. <laughs> no, because like you still be friends, yeah. but it has to be it can't the be boundaries. The same. Boundaries, boundaries are very important. It has to be boundaries. But um yeah, yeah I think that's it for the dating mistakes if you guys have other dating mistakes please let us know in the comment section i hope you guys enjoyed this video i really enjoyed having you on oh, it stop. <laughs> i hope you guys want me to bring adobe you back on another, another topic please bring me back now <laughs> to come bring back. adobe back aka <laughs> right, love if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe please join the fam guys and i'll see you in my next one bye, bye.